The Curve Slot tool allows you to create an arc shape on your panel. This is used often to create standard fan vents on a panel, but can also be used to create other non-standard shapes when combined with other shapes. For this demonstration, I will create a fan vent, which is a series of four curved slots and four drill holes. Fan vents are usually more easily created using the macro library. However, this will give us a brief overview on how to use the curved slot tool in the event that the shape you desire is not available in the macro library. I begin by selecting the curved slot tool at the top of the screen. Next, I press the M key and enter the predetermined coordinates for my first curved slot in the series of four. When I hit OK, the curved slot properties window will automatically appear. I begin by entering in the inner radius. For this fan vent, I will use an inner radius of 8 millimeters. Next, I enter the width of the curved slot, which is 3.5 millimeters. Notice when I enter the width, an error message displays in the preview window. This is because the width I have chosen is less than half of what is currently selected as the corner radius, and therefore the shape is not possible. To fix this, I change the corner radius to 1.75 millimeters, and the preview returns. Now I return to arc length and enter in 80.24 degrees. The arc length refers to how long I would like the arc to continue. If I enter in an arc length of 360 degrees, I nearly have a complete circle. However, I will keep this curved slot at 80.24 degrees. Lastly, I enter 135 degrees for the rotation. As you can see, I have created the upper left curved slot for my fan vent. You might notice the tool selection option. Front Panel Designer will automatically select the best tool to use, taking into account the size and corner radius of your curved slot, as well as the flexibility and limitations of the machinery used to mill your panel. Therefore, it is suggested that you leave the automatic selection box checked. I hit OK and the curved slot appears on the panel where I positioned it. Next, I will quickly create a drill hole to the upper left of this curved slot in order to create the entire element in an efficient manner. Now, rather than create four separate curved slots and four separate drill holes, I will use the rotate tool to do this very quickly. I will start by changing the origin to the reference point of the curved slot. Then, Using the Select tool, I select both the curved slot and the drill hole. Selecting both allows me to apply my next action to both objects as if they were one. To bring up the Rotate tool, I hold down the Shift key, then press the T key. I enter 90 degrees into the rotation field, then hit OK. A copy of the curved slot and drill hole now appear 90 degrees from the original objects. Now, I want to create another set 90 degrees away from the last set. I simply hold down the control key and press R to repeat my last action. I do this once more and I have now created a fan vent consisting of four identical curved slots and four drill holes.